So are we actually getting what we're paying for? Are they taking advantage of us? We're paying top dollar for these bottles, but we don't know what's inside. We don't know how much liquid is inside the bottle. And after last week's video, when I was pouring this into a shot glass and I noticed it was half empty, and after reading the reviews online that multiple people are buying this bottle and they're opening it up and it's half empty, I decided to take some action. So I went online and I bought this glass beaker. We're gonna test this out in a measuring cup and we're gonna see if what they promise us, 750 mils, is that gonna be in there? Or is this 375, is that gonna be in there? We're gonna open them up, we're gonna test them out, and we're gonna expose them. All right guys, so welcome back to the channel. We're gonna start with the Classe Azul. I don't have the 750 mil bottle that's unopened. I have an open one, but we wanna do an unopened bottle, so it's fair. This is the 375 ml bottle. This retails at about $115, which, in my opinion is completely overpriced, but that's not about this video today. Let's open this up, let's pour it into the measuring cup, and let's see how much liquid is inside. All right, let's get started. Let's get this open. All on camera, all on camera. Everyone sees I took it off for the first time. All right, got that open. Let's open up the glass measuring cup and you can see this goes up to 1000 mls so plenty of room for testing you know this is the first time i'm actually opening up the small bottle i've never opened up a small bottle of class s before kind of interesting let's see does this work the bell on this one works as well all right back to business back to exposing all right this is cute little bottle guys <laughs> that's funny all right here we go here goes nothing so we're expecting 350 mls you know we're gonna give them every single drop we're gonna put every single drop we're gonna give every single drop into this measuring cup. <laughs> All right, what do we have here? Moment of truth. All right, we are 350 ml, or is that 375? Is that 375? It's 375, guys. 375, exactly Woo! as promised. I don't know if you'll be able to see, but my hands are shaking and you can see that it's just under the 400 ml line. So in the 375, Class Azul is actually being honest. Wow. So let's pour this back in here because I don't feel like drinking this today. All right. All right, so Class Azul, as promised, in their baby bottle, uh, 375 mLs, as promised, measured accurate. I wasn't really too concerned about this bottle. I was more in question to this bottle. Now let me just rinse this real quick. Okay, now from last week's video, if you guys remember, I barely poured a shot of this to taste to see how it's gonna compare. Um, I didn't feel like going out and buying a new bottle because I have this one. So in my calculations, I'm going to assume that maybe there was about 20, maybe 30 mLs that was, that's gonna be missing from here. Um, if even that. So this is a 750 ml bottle. Uh, I'm going to be conservative and say that we're going to try to measure for 700. Now, if it's nowhere close to 700, then we have a problem and we're exposing the brand. Let's get this poured. Now, 700 should be a lot more 
Okay. 500, 600, 600. I need to see what this says. I think they're short. Let's give them every single drop. Every single droplet out of here. Let's give it to them. We want to give them the benefit of the doubt. We want to give everyone the benefit of the doubt. All right, guys, the moment of truth. I'm not going to lift this up because I want to see on a real level what it's at. But let's see. Um, guys, we're low. Guys, we're low. We are at, okay, I'm going to lift this up. We are at 600. We are at 600. I did not drink 150 mLs of this. I drank a shot glass. You know what? I'm going to pour the same amount that I poured into my shot glass last week on this video, and we'll measure it together how much I drank. Hang tight. Here we go. I'm so happy I'm doing this in my kitchen. I have everything accessible. This is the shot glass that I poured. Let's see. Let's see. Let's see if it's totally full. And I think I have a small measuring cup as well. Yes, here it is. Okay, so this one, this one goes up to 60 mLs, right? Goes up to 60 mLs. Let's see how much we have in here. Full glass. This is if I didn't drink it, right? Uh, 30, 35, let's say 35 mLs. So if I had 35 mLs, that should still give me 715 mLs. I'm gonna pour this back in so you can see where we're at where we're at, and this is very concerning actually, because that's a big deal. We are at, my friends, I don't know if you could see that on camera, we are at just over 600. That's, we're talking about, let's say I drink 50 mLs. We should be at 700. That means there's 100 mLs less than <gasps> promised in this bottle. Now, is that the way they're selling it? Was there some sort of a leakage? Uh, I'm not the only one. I actually read the reviews last week before doing the video, and there were multiple, multiple, multiple reviews saying they open up the bottle and it just feels half empty. It's not half empty, but 100 mLs, and it's probably more than 100 mLs. Now, on a case of, let's say, six, that's almost a bottle. This is a hundred dollar bottle. So I don't know how we're gonna expose them. I'm gonna write the company an email. I'm gonna tag them in this video. Uh, let's find out what's going on because if they're promising us 750 mLs, we're paying full price. We're not paying a discounted price, right? If they're giving us less than 750, then we should receive a discount. And if they don't, then I believe that the price should be adjusted. So I'm gonna expose them. I'm going to write them an email. I'm going to write them on all social medias. And let's see what they do. Let's see what they do. Let's see what they tell us. Let's see whose fault it becomes. So that being said, I'm really glad that we did this video. I'm really glad that I got the comments last week regarding this video to actually get this measuring cup and do this. So yeah, guys, if you've had a similar problem with any of these bottles, let me know. Write them in the comments below. Maybe we can expose those bottles as well. I definitely want to test the 750 size. Maybe I'll do that next week. Um, but yeah, for now, I'm not really concerned about the Class Sassoul because it feels like a full bottle. It doesn't feel like they're skimming. No one has been writing that they've been skimming. This is actually concerning. I mean, this is... Yeah, obviously, we're buying this for the bottle. Obviously, it's a show bottle. But listen, no one wants to get taken advantage of. So on that note, like, share, subscribe, and cheers.